We're almost at the end of our act of worship this morning. So I'd like to say thank you to Anne and to Lynn, to Sarah and Jackie for their reading and praying. And thanks to Shirley for the editing, for her creative surprises and the bundles of patience. And thank you to Robin for arranging the hymns and his playing and also his own creative surprises. If anyone would like to read a lesson or lead some prayers, please feel able to offer yourself. The only technical skill required is that you can record a video on your mobile phone and send it via WhatsApp to Shirley. Our readers today manage that without any great difficulty. And if you'd like to, but you're not too sure, please feel able to get in touch. Next week, the preacher will be Andrew Graydon. And the week after that, on the 5th of July, we'll share in the Lord's Supper. So please be forewarned. And if you'd like to prepare your own bread and wine, we shall share in a virtual communion. And so our final prayer. Loving God, help us to go into the world with a spirit of healing love, to live out faith, belief and discipleship. May we, your followers in this generation, go to meet our world with your blessing, with the example of Jesus ever before us, and the energy of the Spirit driving us. And so we say together the grace. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen.